Gentlemen, you still here? Sir George's company must be most alluring. Your continued attachment to Cornwall is heartwarming. Does the climate suit you? Frost. As opposed to London, which I imagine remains rather hot. Your husband thinks he has triumphed, ma'am. Blackened our name. Helped my daughter abscond with a despot troll. He now hopes to see me arrested for corruption. And perjury, sedition, brutality, murder. <laughs> Do you hear that, ma'am? He intends to have me indicted as a traitor. I intend to have him hanged as one. Care to wager he'll get there first? Ross, come away. Let, let me have a drink. I understand Captain Poldark has been absent from London these past few months. And with good reason. His name is reviled in Westminster. On account of? His Jacobin leanings, his fondness for traitors. Ah, you refer to Colonel Despard. Perhaps Paul Dark should join the French army. Since he stands no chance of ever being readmitted to the English one. <laughs> is treachery a matter for mirth, sir? D treachery works both ways, sir. If your own country betrays you, to whom do you then owe loyalty? <laughs>